What's up, y'all? Hope you're doing well. Hey, this morning, I am thinking about leadership again. Um, but I'm thinking about uh, cold water leaders. You're thinking, what, what, what is that? Um, I don't know if, if you guys have ever watched Seinfeld, but I, I was thinking about this episode where uh, George Costanza was changing and uh, after swimming and somebody <laughs> walked walked in and he said, I was, I was in the water, the water was cold. And, um, and you know, he was referring to, to some, to some shrinkage. <laughs> um, but the, 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 the tie or the connection to leadership was, you know, I, I think some, some leaders have this, this shrinking effect on the people that they lead. And, you know, it's, you know, it's one thing to know the systems or to know the business uh, that you're involved in. Um, but, but there's this capacity issue when it comes to people that, that leaders can either make people, um, you know, grow and get, and get better and grow into their full potential and, and who they are, um, or, or to kind of have this, this, this shrinking effect, right? Um, and, and it's huge, it's massive because, you know, there, there's direct correlations between, you know, whether, whether it's just profit results or, or any of those important metrics that you're trying to achieve in your business or on your team or even in your house um, you know back to you know trying to get kids to put their put their clothes away um, you know we, we can get those immediate results through through fear or or that, that that shrinking effect actually when when you when you make somebody feel feel smaller or feel like uh, paralyzed in the sense that it's kind of like oh, I'll just do what I'll just do whatever you're saying um, that's fine and I think you can get some short-term results and I think that's where um, some sometimes really res result driven leaders I think sometimes can get uh, caught in that trap but the long-term play if you're trying to grow something sustainably if you're trying to maximize results or trying to trying to reach your full potential you're gonna need everybody around you to, to, to grow as well um, so anyways I just wanted to, to drop that uh, line today and just to encourage you um, to, to use a little bit of warmth right and how you deliver it sometimes it's not so much what you say um, but often how you say it and, and um, you know I, I see I see leaders sometimes really un unfortunately try to try to, to to get a result and um, you know they're there's there's sometimes I'll put it this way there's sometimes collateral damage that we may get a get a, a, a immediate result but then also there can be some cleanup afterwards so I just want to encourage you today whether you're coach teacher parent uh, business leader that um, if, if you bring in a little bit of warmth bring in a little bit of empathy and help meet people where they are and, and really kind of unpack the, uh, the mission or the why it goes a long way so I just want to encourage you that today and hope you have a great day. All right, y'all. See you.